Hello and welcome back to another satisfactory guide and today we're going to be talking about some more complicated junctions for parallel circuit railroads in satisfactory. Now if it's your first look at trains you may want to check out my video on rail basics and slightly more advanced single circuit locomotive layouts and junctions. Now if you do find this video helpful I do ask that you drop me a thumbs up as it helps others find this video and also if you want to see more don't forget to subscribe as we do post satisfactory videos weekly. A parallel circuit railroad is going to be very useful once they implement rail collision. Thankfully we're jumping ahead by creating a parallel system from the get-go. Now a parallel circuit works very similar to road designs. So for example one lane sends traffic in one direction and the other lane sends traffic in the opposite direction. Now this can make junctions a little bit tricky, so let's get started with a simple merge between the two parallel lines to create a kind of squished circle. Um, now we, we're going to do this by creating two 180 degree corners, either by using two 3x3 grid 90 degree corners or four 45 degree corners. The other option is you could just run a large loop and then cut through the rails. It's your choice, that's the other option. And in regards to both of these layouts, you can then do the same further down the track in a different direction so that both lanes can swap sides whilst keeping the correct direction. Now our second junction is the common T-junction and here we connect the two parallel lines to the main parallel line. Now as you can see we need to merge the lines with the same direction lane on the other line. This means that the main line will have three segments on each line as well as an end segment on the line being merged to make the merge easier. And as you can see, you should be able to run everything quite easily in the right direction from this layout. Now the third junction starts to get more complicated, however we do have two options for doing this. The first is rather easy as it is the same roundabout that we did in the previous video, except rather than merging each of the lanes into one, we keep them as two separate parallel lines. Now make sure that you do create the circle using the 45 degree angles as currently the 90 degree corner cannot create a complete circle. Now the second way to do this is much more complicated whereby each parallel line has to split and merge onto the two other crossing lines. Now make sure to merge them in the right direction. If you're getting confused, consider adding a non-moving locomotive in the direction you want each line to, lane to go, just so that you can visualize it and easily refer to it. Also make sure that each split is only split into two lines. If you split a point and it separates into three lines you're going to have some serious issues and bugs um, to do with this. So we try to avoid it where possible. Try and stick to just splitting into two lines. Now in order to do a five-way junction that connects a main line with three other parallel lines, repeat the T-junction that we showed second along the main straight line. So you can do a T-junction along the main track, another T-junction and another. Now once you've finished with your rail layout, you'll need to tie up any loose ends by creating a loop. Now this is quite simple, we did it in the first video. It is just a circle, although you can remove the last segment in between the two junctions and it just connects one lane to the other. So there you are guys, that was a very quick guide focusing on the more complicated junctions on a parallel circuit. Now I do recommend if you were struggling to keep up that you just pause each video and try and copy out the layout because it is very difficult to try and explain. But if you did find this video helpful please do drop a thumbs up and if you want to see more don't forget to subscribe. Also if you do have any questions and you want a quicker response than on here do check out our satisfactory community discord channel uh, which you can find 
by the link below. Anyway guys, until next time, thank you so much for watching. Ciao for now.